Hello everyone, welcome to Tector.com. In this short video, we will solve a problem which was asked in K2009 for mechanical engineering. And the question is something like this. For matrix M, which is given here, the transpose of matrix is equal to inverse of matrix. That is, M transpose is equal to M inverse. The value of X is given by. So, for this x, what would be the value so that it satisfies the condition that when we take transpose of this matrix, it will be equal to inverse of this matrix, right? Now they have given four options and we have to solve it. So what you will do? The simple approach is like you take transpose of this and you find out inverse of uh, inverse of this and you uh, like go for equating them and solving them but a very simple approach is there as they are saying that the transpose of the matrix okay is equal to inverse of the matrix this line the transpose of the matrix is equal to inverse of the matrix which means it is a orthogonal matrix it is a orthogonal matrix fine so as we know that the orthogonal matrix is what orthogonal matrix is a matrix whose transpose is equal to inverse okay so this is orthogonal matrix and we know that for orthogonal matrix the determinant is equal to 1 right so we know this now we will simply solve this matrix and we will equate the determinant with equal to 1 so what we will be the determinant it will be it will be equal to 3 by 5 into 3 by 5 minus 4 by 5 into x which is equal to 1 okay so this will become 9 by 25 minus 4x by 5 equal to 1 now by solving this you can get x equal to minus 4 by 5 so by simply solving this determinant you can find out the x equal to x is equal to minus 4 by 5 so the option A is a correct option right? so simply by re remembering the property you can sometimes solve the problem very easily and solve your, uh, save your time okay this was simple property of orthogonal orthogonal matrix and we know for orthogonal matrix determinant is equal to 1 so using this property we can easily solve this problem and find out the answer I hope you understand it if you have any doubt ask your question in doubt section thanks for watching